TFNN. Headline news update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 10 a.m. Eastern time on Tuesday, 30 minutes into the trading day. We got markets on the negative side once again. Dow Jones right now, negative 119 points, trading 26,686. S&P is negative by seven points, trading at 29.68. NASDAQ almost flat, negative five points, trading at 8,093. And the Russell negative by four, trading at 15.57. As we start things off this morning, we're going to jump over and take a look at the VIX. Getting some negative action once again, but the VIX pretty muted still. Overnight, you had 1471 at some of the lows, 1444 right now on that S&P volatility index. Let's jump over to the futures markets. We'll start it off with the Dow. Dow futures, September contract, currently trading 26,699. Had been about 30 to 40 points lower at one point or two pre-market. NASDAQ 100, quite a different story. NASDAQ, the closest index to being flat, only negative about five by about five points. You have the NASDAQ 100 trading at 7801, quite a charge higher from where we were at about 4 a.m. of 7743. So you're talking about a solid 60 NASDAQ 100 points from that price level. S&P 500 bouncing off the lows as well. Correlating to that NASDAQ low, S&Ps were down there at about 2965. You're now 2972 as we're making session highs. Crude oil volatility going on there as well. We were up above $58. Back under that level, you have crude trading at 57.61. Gold contract, we were down with a 13.8 handle, 13.88 at one point. Gold trading at 13.93.62 right now. And the euro US dollar trading at 112.07. In terms of what else you have happening out there, Fed. Fed Chairman Powell begins speaking to Congress, pulling that up as we go. So he will be over there for two days to testify in front of the House Financial Services Committee on Wednesday. It may be actually Wednesday. So that out there as we have a July 31st meeting looming and the probability of a cut right now, 100%. The only question is whether it might be 50 basis points, but that's what the market's saying. We will find out. I'm sure he may have something to say on that. Stay tuned, folks. Come back at 10 o'clock. Basil Chapman filling in for Tom at 10 a.m. Then, of course, we have Fast Market, TD Ameritrade, Thinkorswim, Kevin Hicks, and the team at 11. Basil Chapman at noon. Steve Rhodes, Dave White. We'll be back this afternoon. Stay tuned, folks. Have a great Tuesday.